super excited to visit with Susie McIntyre here at Thank the Black you. Hills Talk Show. Susie, it's so nice of you to, to come every year. Well, we've been here for probably about 25 years, probably. Wow, 25 yeah. years. Yeah. Uh, well, I came not only for the Black Hills Stock Show and Rodeo, but when the college finals were here, we were doing some church services. So been around in this area and got a lot of good friends here in the Rapid City area. And it's, it's so nice of you to come every year Thank you. for the church service. Thank and you. Why do you do that? Well, mainly friends, uh, tradition. Uh, we feel like we have something to offer here. Mm -hmm. uh, my husband is a wonderful speaker. God's given me lots of good music of encouragement, and we just love coming back. And when you can have 60-degree days like you did yesterday, we'll be back even more. No. <laughs> yeah. I, you know, 60 some degrees. My I know. Goodness. I know. Well, it's 74 in, in um, Oklahoma today. So, yeah. uh, and then going to drop like it is here. But yeah, we come because we feel like we have something to offer. We've gotten friends throughout the years. Uh, you know, we stay with some friends. Uh, Sutton Rodeo opens the door for us. And I'm still singing the national anthem uh, here for the rodeo. And uh, they asked me to do that. And so, you know, it's just a tradition with us. And I know you grew up in Oklahoma. Yes. And you come from a musical family. Yes, I do. My mama was a singer. Uh, she, you know, of course, they sang in church, her and her sister and cousin and another friend. And uh, she raised us kids up to sing. And when we were rodeoing, my daddy was a rodeo cowboy. We didn't have a, a, a radio. And so she would teach us how to sing three-part harmony. Uh -huh. Three out of the four kids have made our living with singing. Yeah. through music and a lot of success well pretty much success you know it's paid the bills i know you've had some some hit gospel songs yes yes i've been named a uh, female gospel uh, artist of the year uh, christian country artist of the year and uh, female vocalist and you know it, nothing compares though when people come up to me after a service like today and says what you sang or what you said really really touched my heart you know the awards are fine but that's the greatest reward, and if um, if God's pleased. So you like to get out and see the people? Oh, yes, absolutely, yeah. yes, yes. Well, Susie, God bless you, and, Thank and you. we appreciate you coming to Rapid City. Well, I love the Black Hills, and we'll be back. So everybody come out to see us next, next year, first Sunday, we'll be here. Stock show visiting with Miss Rodeo South Dakota, yeah. Martina Luby. Hi, you. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah. Congratulations. When did you become Miss Rodeo South Dakota? So we actually held our pageant November um, 2nd in Brookings, South Dakota, and then I was crowned lady in waiting, and then my official coronation was January 11th, where I actually took over. Cool. Congratulations. Fun? It's been so much fun so far. The things that I've gotten to do so far as a rodeo queen have been incredible, and I have no idea what the rest of this year holds, but I know it's going to be phenomenal. Yeah. You're from Sturgis? I am from Sturgis, okay. yep. I'm the fifth woman from Sturgis to win Miss Rodeo South Dakota. Oh, okay, well, congratulations, and thanks for visiting with us. Yeah, thank you guys so much. brought a bull down for a friend that lives up along the border of Canada and and uh, he's calving cows right now and we're trying to promote his herd and his program with the bull down here at the stock show. Uh, he's a two-year-old bull that his sire is uh, Little Joe, KR Little Joe and we're just hoping to come down here and win and take some money home. Getting them all groomed up, huh? Yep, yep. Yeah, we've been working on him here all morning, trying to get him all clipped up and ready to go for tomorrow. Jerry Galloway from Dumas, Texas. Quite a booth you got here, Jerry. Well, I hope everybody likes it. I, I, uh, I'm a bit and spur maker by trade and been coming up here about 22 years. So uh, get to where I know a lot of these people up here and always a good show. 
we, the weather cooperates, it really makes it nice. When did you first start making spurs? Oh, about 92 or 3. I'd farmed and ranched all my life and just got to where I was needing what I, want, what I wanted, not what I could buy, and I was getting a little cheaper all the time, so I just started making stuff. 